to our top story now. A Central Texas contractor caught in North Dakota. We first reported on Clayton Construction earlier this year after victims say he took their money and didn't complete the job. Well, that contractor, Clayton Yost, was arrested in North Dakota and is now being transferred back to Central Texas. Six News reporter Adriana Alexander is live in the newsroom for us tonight with details of how this arrest went down. Adriana. Chris Lindsay Yost was accused of taking hundreds of thousands of dollars from people he told would get improvements made to their homes. Alleged victims spread across McLennan, Blanco and Williamson County. McLennan County Sheriff Parnell McNamara told me Yost fled McLennan County and was hiding in North Dakota. He was found in a hotel in Kildeer, North Dakota in late January. His capture happened with the help of U.S. Marshals Lone Star Fugitive Task Force and the McLennan County FAST FAST unit. McNamara says Yost is responsible for scamming people out of hundreds of thousands of dollars and some people even millions of dollars. One of the many victims explained how his capture came as such a relief in hopes they will somehow some way get the nearly $200,000 they spent back. It, it, it was so easy to get to, to believe him and to think that what he was doing was, you know, and then to even feel sorry for him when he came crying and, you know, wanted more money and you felt like, you know, as a good human being, you were trying to help someone and you, you thought that he was being honest when all along he was just taking our money. Sheriff McNamara says there is no bond out of the state warrant, so Yost will sit in the Kildeen jail for a while as they work to bring him back to McLennan County. Hear from another person who had Clayton's business on an advertisement, not knowing what Yost was doing to customers who wanted to do business, guys. There's going to be a lot of victims to weed through and sort out here once he gets back to town. I'm glad they found them, though. Adriana, thank you. Yeah, incredible story, like something out of a movie. Thank you.